So we're almost finished with the bag. We've sewn it all now. What we have to do is we have to clip the two bottom corners. So I'm going to just go in with my nice sharp shears and I am going to clip a little triangle piece off the corner. If you've made your pin cushion, you've already done this. We're just gonna try it again on this other bottom corner. Okay, so I've clipped both bottom corners and now I'm ready to turn the bag inside out. The next step you'll need to do is install your case, the drawstring into the casing. Uh, actually, I'm gonna press it real quick. Okay. Last step for completion, you're going to press, so we flipped it inside out. I did have some other strings that I had noticed, so I trimmed those off. And now I'm just going to press the bag and you're going to need to cut a piece of your um, either drawstring. I, I'm using ribbon. In the classroom, we have a really thin cord. Um, you will cut it. Um, I can't remember the exact measurement. I don't have the instruction sheet here with me. I did mine like three times the width of the bag, so I measured that way. And that's how I determined. But you have an exact measure you'll have when you're actually doing this. So you're going to take a safety pin put it through, not the very tip because you don't want it to come unraveled, mine's about a half inch down, but then I close the safety pin and I'm just going to start in the opening of the casing and you just basically push with your thumb, kind of gather it up a little bit and then pull. So you're going to push through, pull, push and pull. And we do that all the way to the other end of the opening. Okay, so I made it to the other opening. Now I'm just gonna turn and put this in the other opening on the other side. So you just go all the way around. Until we get to the very end. Yours should be extremely easy just because you are using that really thin cord and it's satin so it slides through really easy. Um, if you do have any trouble, it could be that your safety pin that you chose was too large um, or that you maybe made a mistake in your top stitching and so your casing is too narrow. Um, if it gives you any trouble, then you might just let me know and we can see if it's something that you need to re-sew, redo, or just get a new safety pin. So, all right, you are finished. Gather this up around. Okay, and all done. So then you can pull it and then tie a bow. You'll have instructions on how to turn this in, um, but you'll probably just want to make sure that your name and all your other information is on your scoring guide. And I do like them just to be put down inside of the bag to be turned in, but that's the finished project. Okay, you're, you're gonna use this every day in sewing class to store all of your materials in. So instead of bringing your whole tray with you to your seat, you can just bring this and it'll have all those important things that you need.